The mythical creatures bestiary. Uh, dude, what is up with seals and horses? Is this gonna be some story about f***ing horses now? Oh man, let's go. I wanted to quickly tell you about one of our amazing sponsors. Back nope, let's get into the Kelpies. One has something scary. Alright, this f***ing intro and everything is just- this is, this is already too much for me, holy sh**. Maybe I should've listened to your sponsor. village in Scotland. It was a very peaceful and serene area with a gentle river not too far away. Until the Kelpies showed up and f***ed everyone with their horse cocks. Is that where this story is going or what dude is that where we're going here i never met my father i figured he left the family before i was born he went to frank kelpie grandmother ever talked about him so i never really asked about him i had a horse phase but i was slowly growing out of it uh oh so kelpies are coming dude something that i wanted for my birthday but i didn't think my mom would be happy about it i want a kelpie majestic white horse oh no ever seen. smooth and shiny its mane was long she wanted to fuck the horse or what it turned its sparkling black eyes toward me. Felt compelled to go closer. Don't fall it for it. It's strange, a furry. But, but I felt it inside me. It was so weird. She felt the horse inside her. It was so weird, dude. That's where this is going. Was everyone freaking out? Apparently, apparently you Scottish and Irish people are the first furries. I don't know if you knew this, Ryan and, and Lacuna, but apparently you guys are the first furries. I Wait, I gotta ask you, Ryan, Ryan and Lacuna. Have you ever had even the slightest urge to freak a seal or horse? Honestly, just be honest with me here. Tell me the truth. Has the slightest urge ever passed you in that? Because damn, dude, according to these stories, fucking hey, dude. I got... <laughs> You gotta see what you're missing, yeah. Goodbye. I told my family about the horse that I saw. Are you sure it was a horse that you saw? I'm positive it was a horse. Fucking horse, it was dude. so beautiful. You should probably stay away from the river. And don't stay. Really don't go by the river after that. Gesture. Why didn't they just believe me? I told her that I was really close to finishing my book. So I went back to my favorite spot. And there's the horse looking at me with fuck eyes. I didn't know what to do. The horse is so beautiful. He's looking at me with fuck eyes. Whoopee. Kristen, don't, don't, don't question what I just said right there, all right? We're watching fucking Scott. Scottish folklore they fucked seals and horses wasn't even gonna ask why that's a good thing you weren't a, you weren't gonna ask that because it, it, it's not something I'm prepared to answer I love horses invading my thoughts and talking to me in my head I heard someone calling my name she smiled warmly and gestured for me to follow her come now I knew I wasn't supposed to follow strangers deeper into the forest but she knew who I was I closed my book and followed her uh -oh. stranger danger hey if there's any kids watching don't you dare follow that strange horse into the woods when the kelpie asked you to come further in the woods just say no kids we don't fuck horses just say no to kelpies it's all yours dear happy birthday it's all yours dear happy birthday bro what the fuck am i watching and listening to what the fuck are you guys having me watch the shit's wild out there in scotland and ireland bro you got seals and fucking horses fucking people i don't know if i want to come back to scotland and ireland now because i don't want to get Thanks. fucked by horses horse or seals man nodded. my father was out there somewhere and sent this horse as my birthday gift but in that moment all of my concerns sort of veered away. toward the horse cock the only thought on my mind was was horse cock i needed to ride that horse <laughs> No! No, dude! It fucking- <laughs> No fucking way! No! <laughs> All right, let's see where it goes. Let's see. Let's see. It was even more gorgeous up close. <laughs> no! <laughs> no fucking way, dude! Whoa, okay. All right, let's finish the video. Let's fit. We got, we got, we got three minutes left. Let's finish. As if under a spell. Wow. And reached out to stroke its mane. Yeah, that's what that's you stroked. It's mane. It's mane. Quote unquote. After this gorgeous horse, you have to ride it. You stroked its mane. Right. Yep. What the fuck? <laughs> but after one stroke, I realized something was very wrong. <laughs> Something's very wrong after one stroke, bro. All right, what, what went wrong? I have to know. Pan was stuck. <laughs> <laughs> stuck. No one even linked this. I just clicked on. No, her hand stuck. <laughs> No, dude, her hand is stuck after one stroke. Okay, okay, wait, wait. It, uh, I'm assuming the worst. Okay, this face looks like something other than what it is. This is it gotta be something else. While I frantically tried to pry it off, I heard the woman laughing maniacally behind me. And suddenly, I shot. 
I don't know if that gunshot was a gunshot. They're sticky, slimy horses. That, that's never a joke. Yeah, don't don't joke about sticky, slimy horses, bro. All right, wait, there's a gunshot. This is serious. They're in America now. There's gunshots. They're at school. What happened? Now hold still. I ducked my head and felt liquid fire tear through my fingers. So what happened here is that grandma saw her granddaughter just jerking off a horse. Her hand got suddenly sticky and the grandmother knew she needed to put this furry out of existence before it got too carried on. Is that what I'm picking up? All right, no, I'm joking. That's a joke. Shot my hand. That's the only way to get you out of the sticky horse. Yeah, how are you supposed to get your hand unstuck from that horse, dude? Let me tell you, that's a sticky horse. Horse, bro. I understand her plight. The grandma's just trying to save her, maybe. Maybe she's in the right. I grabbed my bleeding digits with my other hand and screamed. Bleeding digits. No, this is such a bullshit story. Because if you got shot in the hand by your grandma, your fucking recounting of the story would not be, I grabbed my bleeding digits. Really? If you guys, if I ever fucking say that, if I if I ever tell you a story about how I, my fucking grandma blew off my fingers, and I say I grabbed my bleeding digits, just know instantly, I am not the same person. There's no way. Zero chance she had shot my hand you yeah, know she shot your bleeding digits after my bleeding digits with my oh she said it again <laughs> No fucking way, she said it again, dude. I, I grabbed my bleeding digits. My bleeding digits, Kristen, my bleeding digits got fucking bleeding. G God damn it, Grandma. You fucking made my digits bleed. I ran toward my grandmother while the horse's body- Why? She shot your fucking fingers off. She ran to her grandmother after her grandmother shot her fucking fingers off the horse cock. What are you doing? Her grandma sucks. That's what we've established. Let's keep watching. Here we go. I ran toward my grandmother while the horse's body began to shrivel. Oh, the horse's body body began to shrivel yeah that's what shriveled after my grandmother had bandaged my hand and i had calmed down so the grandma fucking shot her fingers off the horse because it got sticky her hand got sticky the body shriveled up and then she runs to her grandma who just in cold blood shot her fucking fingers off and seeks comfort hey grandma you just shot my fingers off here let me come over to you grandma's supposed to give cookies hey ryan this is fucking scottish folklore all right scottish grandmas are hardcore as shit bro they'll fucking shoot your hand off a horse cock in a second they're not giving you cookies. They're shooting your hand off a sticky horse cock, dude. That's it. What the hell happened back there? What the hell happened, Lucy? How the fuck could you let me shoot your fingers off a horse cock? What the fuck are I you doing? I'm so sorry, V. She's <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry. But I had no choice. Dave, she's got no choice. That Kelpie was going to drag you into the river and drown you. Oh, it all makes... Okay, I take back about what I said about Grandma. She, the, the Kelpie is going to drag her off into the river and drown her. Dude, Grandma just fucking takes the 12 gauge out, blasts your fingers off. Hey, what happened? Whoa, whoa, what the fuck? What's going on here? You got bloody hand? I'm sorry. So I'm so sorry. It's the only way to get... A, a, it was the only way to get her hand. It was the only way to get your hand off the shriveled horse cog. All right, come on, be reasonable. It's the only way. What's a Kelpie? They're malicious horses that live near the water. They try to get jerked off by the water. Watch out, V. Look out for those fucking malicious horses by the water. They try to get your hand on their wiener and you get stuck and there's no going back. The Kelpie's gonna drag your ass to fucking hell. Look they out. They can shape shift into human beings. Oh, 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 they can shape shift into human, oh, okay. And trick you into riding their sticky bodies. <laughs> Yep, that's what they're tricking you into riding. They're sticky bodies. How your father died. <laughs> <laughs> no! What? Oh my god. The f what a twist. The father died because he's jerking off Kelpies in the forest. Fuck! Damn it, dad! Why you- why are you jerking off the Kelpies in the forest, bro? I took a moment to let that new information sink in. That's how your father died. He jerked off a horse. I would It would take me a moment to let that information sink in, too, to be honest. Because we didn't yeah. want to believe that's what happened, V. Yeah, we didn't want to believe you jerked off a horse, V. Grandma had to shoot your digits off. But why didn't we move? Why didn't we leave this area? Yeah, why the fuck didn't we move if you saw Dad jerking off a horse and just get dragged into the river? What the fuck, Grandma? Because we didn't want to believe that's what happened, V. Yeah, okay, that's understandable. Understandable. That's honestly, honestly, I can see why the lore is the way it is. They didn't want to believe that her father got dragged off into the river by a horse that he was touching dick with. That makes sense. That is the most believable thing I have ever fucking heard from this folklore so far. We moved to the city shortly after, far away from any large body of water. Yeah, any large body of water and any large body of horse cog. I may have lost a piece of me that day. You lost more than a piece. You lost a couple bloody digits, V. But I also got my birthday wish. <laughs> This keeps getting better. No fucking way. She got her birthday wish. 
She just explained how her grandma blew her fucking fingers off and she jerked off a horse and she got her fucking wish. Dude, she jerked off a horse. She got what she wanted. Don't ask questions. I finally learned the truth. Yeah, what is the truth? I gotta know it. Oh, shit. Did you hear that? Wait, what? Is this the credits? This is everyone involved in this? The, the horse jerking off? Warmth of nature soaps? <laughs> <laughs> I knew warmth of nature. When I watched this video at the first second of the video, I knew that warmth of nature soaps was involved in this. When I think warmth of nature, I think horsecock. Wow, that was fucking great. That was hands down, I think, the most entertaining video. Lacuna and Ryan, thank you for your Irish and Scottish heritage and your folklore. Because holy fuck, I would not have gone down this trail had you guys not recommended Kelpie and Selkie. Because fuck, man, that was great.